Well, the Vice President, Kashim Shatima, has called for the need to use culture to unite the people of Nigeria in order to forge a united nation. He made this known during the celebration of Akeson Day held at Ikberi Remo, Ogun State. TVC News' Kazim Olowe reports. It was a special event designed to celebrate culture, promote unity and development of Iperu Rema Ogun State. The 2023 edition of the Ake Sunday paraded notable personalities, including the Vice President Kashim Shetima, Speaker of the House of Representatives Tajuddin Abbas, Governor Abdurrahman Abdurrazak of Kwara State, Babajide Sonwulu of Lagos, Yaya Bilu of Kogi State, the Deputy Governor of Oyo State, and members of the National and State Assembly. In his speech, the vice president emphasized the need to use culture to unite people in the country. We are here to thank you for reminding us of the sociology and economics of, of cultural festivities in nation building. Through your preservation of these beautiful traditions, you have reinforced the identities and pride of our communities, fostering their patriotism and commitment to pursue our collective progress and nurturing the bonds that binds us as a people. As we rebound in the festivities, let us not forget the lessons ingrained in our cultural tapestry. This diversity within our nation is a source of strength, not division. It is a testament to our adaptability as a people. So we must thank all those who have made this happen from bottom to top. The host governor, Dakwa Abiodun, highlighted the significance of the cultural festival and the role played by Akeson Bale Oja in the history of the Iperu people. The attendant parade of cultural values and heritage during this celebration has increased the inflow of tourists and investors into this state. This we are very proud of. We continue to promote the state's cultural values, both nationally and internationally, to ensure that we harness the age-long potential of our people and our land to further drive indigenous economic enterprises, generate employment, and ultimately make of the state a vibrant and sustainable tourism destination of choice. He said his administration will continue to promote the state's tradition and value, adding that Iperu has become the gateway connecting Ogun State and the rest of the world through the Gateway Agrocargo Airport. Kazim Olowe, TVC News, Ikweru.